Music Pen Multimedia presents the Magic School Bus. Here we go! All right! With a friend? No way! We are back again! Good day, class. My name is Professor Venture, and holy smoke, we're back and back, and we've got all new gear to work with. I think I have the recordings down to the right settings now. So I really hope this one works out. This is like the tenth try I've tried to do this. Oh, Carlos, I cannot wait to hear your jokes. So, which Magic School Bus are we playing today? Oh, I don't know, a little one that's called Explorers Inside the Earth. Oh, man, I am excited. Of all the Magic School Bus games, this one is probably probably my second favorite. First one being Explores the Ocean. I don't know which one this falls under into the order of when they were released. Or anything. Oh, Arnold! the rocks and minerals from my collection. What am I going to do? How woe is me. Well, that's the plot of our game. Lost prison. rocks? Lost minerals? Hmm? Not a problem, Arnold. We'll take a field trip and go directly to the source. All right, sounds good. Oh, oh, we're back in the classroom. Oh, hey, Liz. Yes? Oh, you sly little thing. Oh, that's her little house. Ah, oh, she does a little dancing. That's cute. Anyway, so that's our objective. We have to find one... Ex it Ing igneous. Ugh. Oh man, my words. One igneous, one metamorphic, one sedimentary, and one mineral. That's what we're looking for. Oh, look at you. I remember doing a license. So let's go for a kind of around there. And I like the hair, actually. <laughs> oh, the sounds are back. They are very loud in my headphones, and I will need to turn that down. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, I like it. Okay, we can't really see the ears. Cause it's behind her hair. Ah, nice button nose and a nice smile. I like that. Your name is going to be... Bethany. Bethany. You're going to age at a nice... Good number of a good 20, uh, 29 year old. Just about 30. What a, what an age. What a time to be alive. Right? Right, my ear is itchy. Click on the gear right. shift to find out where this bus can take us. Wait, Liz then is talking. Click on the go button to get there. Okay, so I click on the gear shift, spinning orb, and it shows, I guess it's a canyon. You click the go button. Oh, I remember this. Oh. Oh, I remember this. Oh, this is wonderful. There were some very faint sounds from, like, Tonka Construction there. I could just hear, like, very similar sounds. A lot of these old games, they must have borrowed sounds from each other just because, I know. I mean, you get one sound, why, you know, why make new sounds all the time? But uh, anyway, let's go to the back Welcome. of the bus, Miss Alfrez. So this might be important. Do you feel like helping Arnold find the missing samples from his rock and mineral collection? Okay. Huh. Listen closely. There Listening. are three kinds of rocks. Igneous, sedimentary, and metamorphic. Arnold is missing one of each. One of and each. And he's also missing a mineral. So it makes four. Now, check out those four empty spaces in Arnold's collection box. I see them. Click on one to hear your first clue about the missing samples. Okay. Uh, let's go for... Mineral. Minerals are the oh, building that? blocks of rocks, and many of them oh, take cow. crystal forms. Minerals Hi, are found all over the earth. Arnold's missing mineral is hematite. It would be quite all right if you could help him find it. So we're looking for hematite. Interesting. Click on the rock transformer handle to set the transformations in motion. 
Okay, what does the rock box do? Nothing? Okay, what does this do? Ooh! Erosion is what happens when wind, water, or ice changes what the Earth looks like. Rivers and streams wear off little bits of rocks, and eventually, over thousands of years, they could even carve a gigantic canyon out of desert rock. Cool! That's very unique and neat. So, now I click on this, it goes away? Cool. Alright, what's this do? Now you get oh, to hi. up me and Keisha in whatever outfit you choose. Okay. Click on the arrows to make us try on all kinds of hats, shirts, pants, and shoes. I don't know what that was, but, you know, trying to play these little games, sometimes they're a little unstable. Let's try out some uniforms. Uh, maybe I could hike back to the classroom. All right. Your jokes are lame. What do you got, girl? Cave, here I come. All right, here we... Oh, she looks so good. Don't I look smashing? Oh, yes, Nara. You look fit for a board. <laughs> well, let's get out of this. All right, what's Igneous this? Igneous rocks form when magma or lava cools and crystallizes. Okay. They're usually found near land volcanoes or at mid-ocean ridges. Okay. Arnold's missing igneous rock is pumice. <laughs> I bet you'll be able to replace it. We sure will. What about the sedimentary one? Sedimentary rocks are made when tiny grains get pressed together. They are found in many places, like canyons, vaults, and caverns. Arnold's missing well, we're in a canyon, sedimentary so... rock is shale. We're gonna Can look for some shale. Can you bail him out of this predicament? Sure. All right. Well, we're in a canyon, so let's just exit the bus. And oh my goodness! Kaka! <coughs> wow. Oh, what was that? What's that? Okay, that's probably to go to the next area. Interesting. We'll do that later. What's this? Okay, he took that. What's this? Hey, if this is limestone, then where are the limes? <laughs> Very funny, Carlos. Oh, limestone so is made good. up of ocean no, plants and animals that all got pressed together millions of years ago. Okay, thanks. Thanks, buddy. Just overshine on Carlos' thing. What's this Why looking at? Why do they at? call this sandstone? I don't see much sand. <laughs> sandstone is made of a lot of sand, sand that got squished together millions of years ago. That's one way of making sedimentary rock. Isn't that what I was looking for? No, shale. That's what I'm looking for. What's Liz doing? Hey, Liz. Cut it out. Carlos, she's just helping to erode the earth by digging up that dirt. Lots of well, animals do. stop it. it. You're kicking it in Carlos' eyes. Okay, so these little signs here, these are the games within the game. So, I love about the old educational video games when... Do you have gold oh, fever? I remember this. Pan for gold nuggets by moving Carlos with your left and right arrow keys. Got it. Flip the sister by pressing the space bar. Flip the Good what? Luck. Oh, not again! Oh, the way he shuffles! Oh, I remember this! Oh, okay, so you gotta catch the gold ingots, not supposed to catch the black ones, and you can pick up garbage while you're at it. And anything heavy that you pick up will break your net. So you can't have that. Oh, I remember this so fondly as a child. 53, huh? We can do better than that. So this is Carlos's minigame. Uh oh, completely missed that one. Sacrificing for the garbage, saving the environment and whatnot. Wait, oh, haha, -ha, you thought I was gonna get hit by that bowling ball. Well, not today. Bonk, and bonk, and bonk, and missed it. That was in the right spot. Nice. Oh, I remember this very fondly. Ooh, 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 ooh. I don't remember actually, I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be music. In at this point, but oh, my pants full. Ah, another 95 added to the pot. Maybe it's just because it's an old CD that uh, 
Did the waterfall get wider? It did. Oh, I can't believe I got that. Oh, hoi ho, hoi ho. Oh, I missed the bottle. Bonk. Bonk. And bang. Cut the pot. Yeah. Not, not the. Oh, it's a penguin. Oh, golden penguin, golden penguin. Oh, I went for the gold. I am such a greedy man. Oh, Carlos, why wouldn't you save the penguin? Oh, I did get that last uh, rock at the end. Okay, so yeah, the waterfall is getting bigger as the levels go up. And these are probably going to start to move faster at some point. Yeah, look at me go. All right, here we go. Sacrificing. Oh, now I'm collecting a bunch of stuff I don't need. Hoi! Oh, it's all. That's how. That's how you collect gold. Ah, now my pad is full. Yeah, I'm not sure if there's supposed to be music at this point. It's pretty quiet. Thank you. Oh, now the waterfall is getting even bigger. Oh my goodness. And everything is moving much faster. I can barely get out of it. My pants fall already? That's not good. Man, we're just flying through these levels. Man. Oh, now he's like waist deep in the water. That's because the water's filling up the canyon. Ah, so he's going to drown. Not really. Carl's not drown. Who would tell the rest of our jokes for the rest of uh, time? Right? Number one comedian, right here. Such a clever guy. Uh, oh, did you see that? I let the bowling ball despawn before getting the gold. That's how experienced I am. Learning. That's one of the things I appreciate about uh, these old educational video games. In that, um, wow, level eight. In that it does give the kids a bit of a break. Like, they're learning stuff, obviously, because you have to learn stuff in order to uh, progress through the game. Much like most games. But every now and then, it's just like, yeah, hey, you want to do a, uh, a catch the gold kind of thing with some kind of neat looking graphics. I mean, at the time. But, uh, wow, 89. We're just rocking it. Level 9. Wow, that waterfall's gotten really big. Hoi-ha! I don't know if you can tell, but my space bar is really loud. Hopefully it doesn't pick up. Oh, my inventory's full. All right, last level. And it's a gold rush! Woo! Get all the gold. All right, here we go. Ah, oh, going for the big stuff. I have to sacrifice a little guy. Nice, nice, nice. Nope, missed that one. Nice, nice. Oh, how am I missing some of these? Oh, come on, Carlos, move. You gotta move, buddy. You gotta get all that gold. Oh, man, look how much gold I've gotten. It's a lot of gold, baby. And we got the trophy pot of gold. Woo! Wow, that's impressive. Holding it up on one finger like that. Good job. You've beaten the rapids. Sweet. All right, so we got to beat all these mini games. That's what I'm getting from this. Okay, I can explain. No, I can't. I've been trying to record this like 10 times. <laughs> that, was a, that was the name of the last character. Don't worry about it. Play again? No. Okay, what's that at your feet, Carlos? Are these stuff that I just collecting my box? Hey, if this is limestone, then... Yes, we heard your joke. Okay, so these are all the rocks I'm getting. Why did they... Okay, okay, okay. So let's just click on this sign, play one Welcome more minigame. Welcome to the Fossil Puzzles. The fossil let's puzzles. get started. Nice. Click on the arrows to choose a puzzle piece. Then drag the piece to where it belongs. Sure. Good luck. All right. Let's go hard. Ugh, again. Stop it with your... Stop it. Stop it. Oh. Oh, gosh. It's all going wrong. Anyway, now we're back. I don't know why it keeps closing like that, but uh, so far this has been a pretty, pretty entertaining episode. I've also discovered that, you know, this must be 
either the second or the third game in the series because Liz still talks and the graphics look a little bit better than Space did, but you know, it's 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 not quite there yet. It's not the max potential. Oh, I'm impressed. Yeah. You should see how well I play some other games. I'm so good. But yeah, I've noticed that that doesn't go there. Okay. This must be like the second or the third game in the uh the series. And yeah. Where does this go? Yeah, I'll just do that one later. Screw it. Uh, where does this go? Does this fit in there? Nope. So, you know, it's been a pretty good, uh, pretty successful first episode. I don't know where any of these pieces go. All right, let's try the next one. Should be able to get this one at least. There we go. I mean, we started by getting some clues for our rocks. We got some gold, and now we're just finishing up with a nice puzzle. Ah, dang it. This got to go somewhere. Right there. Ha <laughs> gotcha. Man, I am so happy this recording stuff. I've gotten new computer, got a new camera, got a new nice light. That's actually very bright in my eyes when I look at it. But, um, yeah, everything is getting better, better, better. Where does this go? This goes there. Okay. And then this one's going to go there. And now we're ending on a nice puzzle, so... Way to go! Thank you! I feel accomplished. So, man, I am so happy things are starting to work out again and starting to get back in the flow of things. So what happened? This is what the floor of the ocean looked like 400 million years ago. Those fish are the oldest fish we know about. They had heavy armor made out of bony scales. Oh... You know, I don't even know what she said, but because I was paying attention to the music, because that music is amazing. It sounds so good. Oh, I actually got chills from how good that music was. I mean, it's just kind of a remix of the Magic School theme, not the not the intro song, just kind of its theme music, but still, very well done. And you know what? That's where we're going to end our episode. So, man, this is going to be a great trip. I am very excited, and there's going to be tons more content coming out now that everything is just starting to come together. Um, so, if you want, you can subscribe to my channel so that you'll know when more fun content like this comes out. Um, Typically, I'll post Tuesday, Thursdays. Those of you who already subscribed, you know about all this, right? <laughs> if you want, you can follow me on social media because I like to talk with some other YouTubers there and just have a bunch of fun. And, yeah, you know, just... If you remember this game or, you know, can't wait to see more of this, just want to chit-chat in general, post in the comments down below. Nice. Yes, this is a good note to end it on. So thank you everyone so much for watching. And until next time, I've been Professor Adventure, and class is dismissed.